Yo guys, what is up? TecherVaults here, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a pretty short and quick tutorial on how to mine LBC, or aka library credits. Uh, now, just a quick introduction. Library credits are the currency that you use for library, the application, the protocol, um, which is an open source, uh, decentralized video sharing platform. So basically you can upload whatever you want there and then people get paid and stuff through library. So um, there's a couple things you're going to need uh, for this tutorial. The first thing is you're going to have to have a library address. Now you can either do that by going to um, library.tv and make one or you can do it how I have it here and have the actual app installed on your computer and you can... Uh, get access to your library address that way. So you just go to library.tv or go to library.com, uh, sign up for an account, download the app or go through library TV and then you can go and get your address um, on here. So once, once you're in the library app, you'll probably land on this page and same with library.tv. And if you wanna go to your address, you go up here, it'll probably have like zero LBC if you just uh, you know made it. But you go up here, click that, and then you just click your address uh, or your addresses here. And then it will show you your library address. And we're going to need this later in the tutorial because this is where um, your library credits will get sent when you're mining. So first thing you need to do here is you need to get a miner program. So in this tutorial, we're going to be using CC Miner. I will have this link in the description below. You're gonna go to this GitHub page here and you'll see something here like uh, version 2.3.1 Windows binaries. So you're gonna go on uh, Windows binaries here and you're gonna go down to assist at the bottom and you're gonna download CC Miner 2.3.1 CUDA 10.7 zip. So you're just gonna click that and it's gonna automatically ask you to download and you're going to save that file. Now, once that's downloaded, um, I, recommend putting, I recommend putting all these files in one place in a folder so you can manage everything. So I'm just gonna go here to my desktop. I'm gonna create a new folder and we'll just call it LBC Miner. Open that up and then I will bring my download of the miner here and we can just drag it over here. And if you're not using Firefox, it'll probably be down the corner, but you could just go to your downloads folder and then drag it over. But there you go, drag it over here. And then now we have this zipped miner. So we're just gonna open this and just highlight everything in this folder and drag it into the folder. And um, now we're gonna have like a readme and stuff, CC miner and all this stuff here. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a new file. So we're gonna go right click. Um, we're gonna do, what are we doing? New, <laughs> new file. Um, we're going to do a text document and you could call this whatever you want. It doesn't have to be the same thing that I'm calling it. Um, call it something that you would remember that starts your miner. I'm just going to start it um, or call it LBC miner start. And then um, you're going to want to change it to dot bat. So B-A-T. And then press enter and yes. And if you can't see, uh, if you can't see this file extension here, just go up here to view and check this box here, file extension names. If it's like this for you and you can't see anything here, make sure you check this box so you can see dot uh, text at the end and then you can change it to dot bat. So once we got that there, we're gonna go up here and we're gonna click edit and it should bring up a notepad for you. Now we're gonna need to get um, some information from our minor pool that we're gonna be using. For this video, I'm gonna be choosing Z pool uh, it is one of my favorite mining pools because uh, you can choose to really mine anything and then you can choose to get paid out in pretty much whatever you want. And if you mine in, if you mine for some other algo and you mine convert it to BD, BTC, it's always a guaranteed payout. So I really like these guys. Um, but for mining LBC, you're obviously going to want to, if you want LBC, you're going to want it to pay out in LBC. So... Down here, they have a nice little generator here, so we can generate uh, the command that we're going to have to paste into that notepad file. So we're going to choose uh, whatever location you're at, whatever's closest to you, because this will affect like how many shares you're getting and stuff, and ultimately how much 
LBC you will actually be mining. Um, Algo, we're going to want to go down here. We're going to want to find library, L-B-R-Y. Uh, Zap, I usually just set this to LBC. And now payout address. So now this is where we're going to need the address that we got from the library application here. So if we go to your addresses, copy that. Go over to Zpool, paste that in. And then for currency, obviously we want to get paid out in LBC. So we're going to go through here and there it is LBC. So we're going to choose LBC. And then now you can see it created this nice little string here. So we're just going to go here, copy that right there. And then we're going to go to our notepad file that we just used to create, um, or we just created right here, the dot bat file and, and opened it in notepad. We're going to control V paste that in. And now we're going to go to the front of the file. Okay. The very, very front. And we're going to put a minus symbol a, um, and then we're going to put L B R Y. And basically what that does there is it's saying what algorithm you want to mine. And we want to mine obviously library. And another thing we're going to need here, we're going to need to go down to CC miner 64.exe. Um, we could just rename this. Control A and copy that full name. And then we're going to want to extend this on to the very front of the file and make sure there's a space right here. And then at the end of the file, I usually like to put pause because if something goes wrong and there is some sort of error that you're having, it will usually just close by itself. But if you have pause, it will pause it and it, you can look on the uh, command prompt and actually see what the issue is. So then you could just control S or you could go to file and save here. And we can close that now and that is pretty much it um, I'm not sure if this will lag uh, when I start it up um, but hopefully it doesn't um, but now we can go here LBC miner and there you go it is gonna open it up and it will start mining here so let's just give it a second uh, there it goes you can already see here uh, both of my GPUs we got 30 mega hashes 26 mega hash is a boom. It's already jumping up to 500 mega hash. Um, so if you want to actually see the uh, progress or you want like a, a view to make sure that it's going through on a Z pool, if you copy your address here or from uh, the library app, go up here to wallet address, paste it in like that. And then boom, it'll bring you to this online uh, dashboard. And if you go down to Miner Summary right here, you can see CC Miner. It's the program we're using, the ID, the algorithm that we're mining, the difficulty it's at, and the hash rate. Now, right now it shows 0.0, uh, 0 hash because basically the pool uh, needs to get some shares from you first. And once you start getting shares, um, then it will update your hash rate and you should start seeing um, earnings and stuff coming in here on the last 100 earnings. Your balance should start changing and stuff like that. Usually, I probably give it around a good 15 to 20 minutes to really let it start going um, and start uh, finding some shares and stuff like that. But yeah, other than that, that is the full tutorial on how to mine LBC on Windows with NVIDIA GPUs. If you guys like this video, please give it a like. If you're having any errors, with your program if it's giving you any errors just feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below if you guys have any other tutorials um oh there you go first share one out of one um at 900 uh, mega hash with both of my gpus combined uh yeah but if you have any other tutorials you'd like me to do please leave those in the comment section below too uh but yeah other than that i hope this tutorial was helpful for everyone and i hope uh, you enjoy your LBC mining journey. Uh, other than that, I will see you all in the next video. Peace.